Welcome everyone to the Beacon sponsored webinar series. Uh, this today's webinar is about legal advice for our contractor community. I am honored to welcome Trent Cotney today. Uh, Trent is the owner, founder, and CEO of Cotney Construction Law. Uh, Trent and I serve on a couple of boards together, uh, but also he's on several other boards. And Trent is probably the premier advocate for contractors across the country. Uh, Trent has 14 offices uh, with 40 plus attorneys, four customer service reps. Uh, Trent has is, is obviously been very active these last, call it eight weeks. Uh, he's, been, he's been doing several of these webinars and we're very appreciative of, of him joining us today. And, and obviously the views expressed by Trent in this interview are, are his. Uh, Beacon doesn't necessarily share in them, but we wanted to provide general information for all of you. Um, and certainly it's not quote unquote legal advice coming from Beacon, but Trent's, Trent's knowledge, Trent's, Trent's industry experience is, is second to none. So Trent, I wanna thank you so much for joining us today and sharing your insights and strategy uh, on how we in the industry can deal with the COVID-19 virus, which obviously has us all very much preoccupied past, uh, present, and obviously for the foreseeable future. Although we are starting to see some, some states open up again, which is a really positive sign. So welcome, Trent. Thank you, Greg. And, you know, I want to thank you and, and Eric and everybody at Beacon. You know, you guys, just to give you, to give Beacon some kudos, you've done a tremendous job in getting education out there. And a lot of the resources, I don't know if your contractors realize, but things like Beacon Pro Plus and a lot of the other stuff that you're doing from a technology standpoint is, is just cutting edge. So, um, you know, I noticed it and, and it's, you've really done a good job. So looking forward to uh, having some good discussions today. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Uh, before we, I, I start with some questions for Trent, I just want to real quickly give an update on Beacon. Uh, and, and let me start with saying safety is our number one priority. It remains the priority of, of the safety and wellness of our customers, of our employees, uh, and, and obviously the communities in which we live, in which we work, in which we raise our families. Very, very important to us. It's our number one priority. So I just wanted everyone to know that. And then secondly, uh, Beacon is open for business. We have over 500 locations in the US. We are serving your building material needs every day. Uh, we are practicing social distancing in every one of our locations. So if you're visiting our branch, we will make sure you feel comfortable. We will keep our, 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 our distance. We're gonna make sure all of our counters are sterilized, uh, sanitized, uh, our door handles, you name it. Everything that, that you find in a Beacon facility will be will be clean and ready to go. Um, we're working very closely with our supply chain partners, our trade partners, our vendors, uh, to make sure that the supply chain is not being disrupted. Uh, things are going extremely well. We really appreciate the support of our manufacturing partners for, for keeping our, our shelves stocked. So also our sales team, both outside and inside, um, they are poised every single day and ready to serve you. We have adjusted hours a little bit, uh, shorten the days a little bit, but but truly we are open for business. Um, obviously, none of our, our our employees are traveling, uh, other than you know going to and from uh, from in a car here and there. But uh, yours truly hasn't traveled on an airplane in seven weeks, so um, we're only a call, a text, or email away. So I just wanted everyone to know that. 